Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Fire Ant Fishing. Uh, today I just wanted to go over how I move my trailer when it's not attached to the truck. Got a couple questions on it the other day and just figured I'd kind of go over it and show you guys because I guess some of you guys don't know what it is, but I call it a trailer dolly. I guess if you want to get real technical, they call it a uh, ultra tow, but it's a really nice little deal. This thing was about 50 bucks at a uh, Norton Tool. That's where I got it. The tires are cheap in my storage unit when I had the 16 foot boat in there. Uh, I had to, when I was pulling it out, I had to make a really sharp turn. And I guess over time, all the weight from the tongue of the boat on that one uh, kind of busted these tires out. So these are different tires I had to get. But ever since I haven't had that boat in the storage unit, um, this thing's been fine. So this is the lowest rated one. They make a higher rated tongue weight one. It comes with an inch and seven eighths ball. All of my trailers are made for two inch ball, but this thing just seems to be fine with it. I mean, you're not moving it very far. And I always make sure to lock it down just in case. So using the thing's pretty much self-explanatory. Put the ball in there, set it down. I always lock this first, just in case. And then you can lift up your jack. Jack's up, that's locked down. And you just come back here, lift up the handle, and then you start moving the whole boat. And it's really simple. So it makes it much, much easier than just pulling or dragging this thing. And it's not gonna wear a flat spot on your jack tire. So that's what happened with my 16 footer. I need to get a new one for that. Definitely helps out, makes life easier. Yeah, I just wanna show you guys that. I know I had a couple questions on it. So I'll leave a few links in the description below. Maybe I can find one cheaper than $50, I don't know. But if you guys enjoy this video, please leave a like. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, please leave me in the comment section down below. And don't forget to subscribe for future content. We're about to start working on this again before it rains all this week. So hopefully we'll get some videos out to you guys soon on that. So. Stay tuned.